Well, hi there, everybody. We're talking bow glitching and more importantly, the consistency of bow glitching, which isn't fantastic if I'm honest with you. So some people have noticed that um, they've lost all of their hair because they ripped it out of their head when they couldn't do the dang glitch. And it's actually a result of a couple of things. Uh, the most common one people say is, oh, it's a skill issue. You're just not doing it quickly enough. But there is something else. You want to make sure you're not in the rain. Um, a lower processing load tends to help with it a little bit. You can get between menus a bit more quickly. Make sure that the, the system doesn't skip any frames. That helps. Uh, but surprisingly, it's the stuff that's on your back. Isn't that crazy? So what's going on is when we do the glitch, the bows are going to drop behind Link and the hitboxes on his equipment will affect how well the glitch will perform and put the items back into our inventory. Sounds kind of nutty, but here, let me show you what I'm talking about. So I've got, um, what is this on here? Probably a uh, Lionel part. We got 42 of them. So I'm just gonna do the glitch normal style real quick. I think that was quick enough, probably quick enough. 44, oh, I must have already had one on there, so it was pre-glitched. Let's do another one. So we got 44. Unless, unless I glitched two at once, because I'm just that good at it. Uh, no. 45. Okay, we got it. We got two in a row. Let's let's do one more. Just just for fun. Just for fun. Let's do it. That might have been too slow. I don't know. 46. No, no, we're good. We're good. So we can do it pretty consistently. I probably get it if I'm actively paying attention and I'm not trying to talk to you guys. Probably seven or eight times out of ten. Pretty, pretty consistent. Uh, the problem was I was ripping out my hair because I couldn't get it to work at one point, and it was because I didn't have the right gear on. If I remove either my small shield or my small sword, um, I think small maces, it just has to be a small one-handed weapon, something with the same hitbox that should clear that up. But uh, if you have, for example, just your bow on your back or only one of those other items, you're going to see here pretty quickly that it just doesn't want to work. No matter what we do, that was nice and quick. They fell right on top of each other. We got 46. Didn't work. Nice and quick. Didn't work. Ah, that was just me. Misinput. But no matter what I did, when I had a different set of gear on my back, or different types, if I had a two-handed weapon on, or something like that, or a big shield, because I've been running around with big chunky shields the past day I was playing, because I like fusing topazes to them. No matter what I did, it just wouldn't work. And as you can see here, we're, I'm doing the same, well, when I'm not messing up, I'm doing the same thing. And it just does not want to work. That one was a bit off. They didn't land together. You want them to land together. They like to, to, to mingle. Hey, that one, that time it actually worked. But as you can see, it it is very inconsistent if you're doing it with the wrong things on Link's back. I think doing it with no items on is a bit more consistent than doing it with just one item. But that's purely conjecture. Might be talking out of my ass. I don't know. But we've gotten a few, but it's not it's not going as well as it was. So let's, uh, let's test that theory. Let's just put my shield back on here. Because apparently the timing is going to change because the hitboxes are changed. So let's give that another go. We have 47. Both drop together. We got 48 there. We got 49 there. Hold on, what's going on here? This is why some people are going nuts because it's just sometimes you get a few and it makes you hopeful and then the rest of the time you don't get it like that one felt perfect and I got nothing felt perfect got nothing Ooh, that one was really good Did I get one nope I didn't and it can be frustrating to be doing this correctly every single time as you saw there those two I did that perfectly but the two bows did not fall at the same time because of the difference in the hitbox. So the timing actually changes. And if you're doing it, like some people will suggest, as quickly as possible, if you don't have the right item combos on your back, that is actually the incorrect timing. So you have to mess it up to get it to work right. And that 
and try intentionally messing up sometime. It is, it's much harder than doing it correctly. Because it's easy once you learn how to do something correctly, but if you have no idea what the timing is, good luck with that. Some people walking around saying, oh, it's a skill issue. They, they just need to take their clown shoes off. But you guys are doing it fine. You just don't have the tools on your back. And I did that one wrong, but here, let's, speaking of tools and putting things on our back, let's put my sword back on there. Just to see. And why did I do that? <laughs> this is what I get for talking. Um, so we're going to drop that. Put that. Boop, boop, boop. That felt good. Might have been slow. 50. Nope, we got it. We got it. 51. 52. As you can see, with both of these items on my back, 53, we're now very consistent. Whereas before, it was only happening every once in a while. And I'm going to be honest with you, I was surprised it happened twice in a row back there. I thought maybe my own hypothesis just got torn in half. That one might have been slow. Oh, 55. I mean, we can do this very quickly. I'm very well practiced at this because I've been I've just been doing some recordings and trying to get this sussed out. 57. And it just works. It just, well, unless you do it wrong. Messed up my order there, I think. 58. As long as you don't mess it up, it'll work every time. Whereas if you don't have the right items on, you can do it correctly all day and it doesn't matter. Now we got 60. See, it's really that easy. And that's all it was down to, is the stuff that's on your back. Anyway, thanks for listening to me rant, and you guys have a fantastic day.